Hello everybody, welcome back to this channel. Today we'll see Terena ISIS. So we are going to uh, generate aspect counter slope and hill shade from digital elevation model for our activity. Digital elevation model is okay, so let us uh, import digital elevation model. And this is digital elevation model that I copied to uh, watershed. So uh, we are going to spatial analyze tool, then the spatial analyze tool uh, surface. First, uh, let us generate slope. Double click here on slope and uh, input raster locate for slope analysis digital elevation model. And uh, let's locate our output to one folder here, our size, and name it as slope and save. You can change output measurements, uh, degree or percentage rise can be used. I'm going to use degree as a factor can be also changed. I'm going to use the optional, which is one, then okay, it's running. Yep, slope uh, map is generated and uh, this one is slope map and uh, we can change the color ramp. I go to property and uh, let's uh, symbol change the class to uh, five six whatever we want i'm going to change to five and uh, and also change the color ramp let's let's use this color ramp then apply and okay this one is the slope map and uh, we can also transparency can be changed let us change the transparency to 10 and uh, apply it and uh, the, the map look like good Okay, then uh, another uh, variable is aspect. So click here on aspect. Then input raster is digital elevation model. And uh, let's locate with where to save our output map aspect. Then save. Then okay. So it is running. And uh, this one is aspect map and this aspect map show the direction of clarifying of uh, slope slope may be to north direction south direction southeast direction uh, west direction and so and uh, we can change the uh, color ramp for this aspect map we can change the color map ramp to yeah let's use the same one that has you then okay yeah this one is the aspect map and we can change the color ramp as of our interest and uh, we have to see also which one is a uh, good for presentation and you can change the color ramp and uh, another uh, variable that we are going to generate is hill shade so click here on hill shade and input raster is digital elevation model output raster output raster shall saved here and uh, say hill shade then save and we can change azimuth uh, altitude and uh, the factor but i prefer to use the optional one and uh, say okay it's running good this one is the uh, hill shade map and we can change the color ramp yeah but uh, for hill shade gray ramp is good and i prefer to use that one one more that we are going to generate is contour map and for contour map we use the elevation and uh, let's save this contour then save Contour interval, I make it 300 because the area is, is rugged topography or steep area. The base contour optional, the factor is optional. Let's accept that this, okay. Yeah, the contour map is generated and uh, let us change the symbol, label. Yeah, let us take this one and uh, label field shall be contour and apply. Okay, 
so you can see the contour map and this area is relatively flat area this one is steep area having rapid topography let's come back and uh, change the property yeah let's come back to symbology and uh, categorize and use the contour for category and add value so this one is the value of the contour and apply and you can see the map which is counter map and uh, let us remove other and this one is a counter map this area is uh, relatively flat area this one is so uh, this one is uh, steep area if the video interests you please don't forget to subscribe like and share